Do you use Blender 3D on a regular basis and dislike the sluggish performance of your current laptop, or are you a beginner who wants a machine that can run it smoothly? As Blender is an extremely versatile application program dedicated to 3D modeling, sculpting, 2D and 3D animation, simulations, rendering, compositing, and almost everything creative, you need extremely powerful gadgets to utilize the same to its full potential. The Acer Aspire 5 isn't meant to drive exceptional creative performances but can certainly hold its own when basic 3D modeling and video editing tasks are concerned. Under the hood, Acer flaunts the graphics-optimized Intel Core i5-1035G1 chipset. Despite being a low-power chipset, the quad-core, octa-threaded architecture can handle basic Blender functionalities with ease. Furthermore, the processor can turbo-clock at speeds of up to 3.6 GHz, if and when required. Graphics-intensive tasks are initiated by the NVIDIA GeForce MX350 GPU. With 640 CUDA cores to rely on, the GPU acceleration levels aren't commendable but can still lend ample support to the processor when basic 3D rendering is concerned. Acer also brings in 2GB VRAM for furthering the viewport rendering performances. Running the software on a sub-$700 notebook is a luxury, but the Aspire 5 aims to achieve the same courtesy of the 8GB RAM. As far as storage is concerned, there is a 512GB SSD module to rely on. The solid-state drive can adequately store the achieved files, datasets, cache data, and the Windows 10 OS, besides speeding up the boot-up process significantly. As a globetrotting creative professional, you need to rely on portability more than anything else. This is where the MSI GF63 Thin comes in the mix, courtesy of a sleeker chassis, and a decent enough specs sheet. For starters, you get an Intel Core i5-9300H processor stacked within, featuring 4 cores and 8 parallel processing threads. Supporting the CPU is the NVIDIA GeForce GTX 1050T GPU, clubbed with 4GB of VRAM. The CPU-GPU hybrid handles basic 3D modeling and production rendering with precision. 3D sculpting performances get a significant boost with 8GB RAM. However, MSI supports upgradability up to 64GB RAM for accommodating more complex processes and 3D requirements. In terms of storage, you get access to a 512GB GB solid-state drive. MSI offers Windows 10 OS, straight out of the closet. The 15.6-inch display is exceedingly color accurate and flaunts sharper viewing angles. With an overall resolution of 1920 by 1080 pixels, this is one of the brightest and most vibrant displays to view models and renders on. Besides, the IPS also flaunts 45% NTSC color gamut followed by thinner bezels for amplifying screen real estate. MSI also makes room for a backlit keyboard, Nehemic speakers with surround sound technology, a handy webcam microphone combo, and an intelligent cooling layout. The brushed aluminum structure weighs a mere 4.1 pounds but doesn't compromise on the connectivity specs, with the main inclusions being USB Type-C, HDMI, and more. The Lenovo Legion 5 is an exceptionally powered notebook that doubles down as a creative ally, courtesy of the exceptional GPU, and a host of other potent inclusions. At the front, you get the AMD Ryzen 7 4800H CPU, which is 46 times faster when compared against the multi-threading performances of the i7-9750H processor. AMD flaunts the SMT or Simultaneous Multi-Threading technology for translating the octa-core processor into 16 threads for better blender usage. Besides, the existing processor can support boosted clock speeds of up to 4.2 GHz, for handling more demanding tasks. Lenovo persists with the GeForce GTX 1660T GPU, which supports CUDA architecture for better real-time rendering and modeling performances, albeit in 3D. Furthermore, the gadget also brings in 6GB of video RAM for efficient handling of renders and creative tasks like photo editing, video editing, and more. Legion 5 accommodates 16GB RAM that processes files and data at 3200 MHz, this attribute is adequate enough for handling complex scenes and poly meshes with ease. As far as storage is concerned, the 512GB unit is one of the better traits on offer. The Gigabyte Aero 15 is our personal favorite,
considering the beefed up specs sheet and unmatched portability considering the seething power underneath. For starters, we get the 9th gen Intel Core i7 chipset, featuring 6 cores and hyper-threading technology. Besides assisting multi-threaded applications with aplomb, the Intel Core i7-9750H CPU also works closely with the GeForce GTX 1660T GPU for better 3D modeling, sculpting, and rendering performances. Besides, the 6GB VRAM is quite a handful for GPU-intensive real-time rendering. The graphics card makes room for CUDA processing, which is something we would recommend for running the latest version of Blender. The NVIDIA Optimus technology is a surprise addition, allowing you to use the integrated UHD Graphics 630, if and when desired. Next in line is the 16GB RAM, capable of handling the more complex scenes and diverse data structures in play. Moving on, you get access to a 512GB 760p SSD. This solid-state storage module is PSI compatible and comes across as extremely power efficient. Gigabyte also brings a backlit, RGB Fusion 2 certified keyboard into the mix, followed by a functional webcam, precision touchpad, responsive fingerprint reader, and Nehemic speakers with surround sound enhancement for a better music listening experience. Another revolutionary feature is the Azure AI user interface, helping the gadget allocate resources as per the task complexity. If you are a creative professional with inclinations towards application programs like Maya, Blender, ZBrush, and more, the Razer Blade 15 is an extremely competent laptop. It has everything you'll need to make sure that all your 3D software runs smoothly. For starters, the Intel Core i7-10750H processor is a commendable addition, courtesy of the 6 cores. Although Razer could have persisted with the octa-core Intel i9, the 10th Gen i7 chipset doesn't disappoint either. The 12-threaded soak, thanks to the hyper-threading support, is a great choice for running Blender. Besides that, the single-core turbo clock speed of up to 5 GHz also comes in handy. Blender also makes extensive use of GPU acceleration, and the supplied NVIDIA GeForce RTX 2070 Max-Q can certainly make a difference. The mobile graphics processor ensures that the optics or ray tracing API availability for future-proofing your Blender indulgences. The 8GB VRAM also plays a major role in optimizing 3D performances. Blender is definitely a video RAM monger if you are interested in high-end rendering that isn't limited to the viewport, poly modeling, and sculpting. When memory allocation is concerned, 16GB RAM is a bare minimum, considering the existing processing setup. However, the dual-channel system memory supports upgradability to up to 64GB. As optimal Blender performances, duplicate, and cache object data related to creative meshes, extensive professional usage will eventually need you to upgrade the system memory to its highest capacity.